Thank you, Nia. We'll let you know when a program is officially selected. The Missouri House of Representatives put the final touches on the state budget, but the conversation quickly turned to what Democrats called racist language and amendments written into the budget. ABC 17's Ethan Hines was at the Capitol today and listened in on the hot topic of Republicans targeting diversity initiatives. Lucas, Megan, all discussions on the floor today focused on DEI, which stands for Diversity, Equity, and Inclusion. Every budget bill has an amendment written into it that would take away money from any entity that the state does business with that includes diversity, equity, and inclusion. The governor and the department heads have come and discussed with us how if this language remains intact, it will completely jeopardize every dollar that the state of Missouri operates with. Representative Quaid said that the focus on DEI by House Republicans was meant to talk about culture wars instead of public libraries being defunded or Missouri teachers remaining the lowest paid in the country. There are so many things that folks ask us at the doors to do and instead we are spending hours talking about these divisive concepts that the Republicans just run to win their elections. With these amendments, Democrats fear the state would lose contracts with companies that have diversity and inclusion policies. We wouldn't be able to have our lights on because Ameren uh, has diversity, equity, inclusion in their mission and staff associated with it. Um, it's absolutely bonkers. Now, Democrat representatives were the only ones in attendance during the news conference. Republican representatives did not attend. Reporting in Jefferson City, Ethan Hines, ABC 17 News. According to Quaid and Meredith, they're both confident these amendments will be taken out once the bill gets through the Senate.